Bearing pain is a difficult proposition for anyone. Some people are inclined to cry or at least sob for a few minutes even if stung by a wasp, but some people undergo excruciating pain under certain agonizing conditions such as getting operated on for eye surgery without anesthesia or experiencing the sting of a plant that can make you feel pain for years. We hope you guys have not suffered any similar painful affliction. Today we'll share with you some exceptionally agonizing incidents that'll give you the chills. So get ready to learn about these unique situations. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more. Stones and Moans You must be aware of kidney stones. Reportedly, every one out of ten persons experiences this horrific problem. Stones are formed inside our kidneys if we don't drink sufficient water every day. Then our urine turns darker and increasingly concentrated due to waste products of the body. At times, the calcium and other minerals in our urine can turn into crystals and stick together. These crystalline formations become intensely painful as they are quite difficult to pass through the urinary tract. Although these stones are formed in the kidneys and they move around inside the body and finally excrete through the ureter, stones reach the bladder and then these are to be flushed out through the pee hole, which can be immensely agonizing. Sometimes stones are not excreted through the body, rather they're stuck inside the kidney and gather there. It creates a blockage in the flow of urine. It leads to swelling and bloating in the kidney. One Reddit user shared his painful experience. He described it as if someone had taken a heated white steel javelin, rolled it in broken glass, and then thrust it into his back and twisted around for hours. The world record for the most kidney stones removed from one individual is 172,155. Luckily, these stones were removed surgically. Grievous Gimpy 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 plant found in Australia looks very attractive and similar to so many other standard nettles, but it possesses a fatal sting that's agonizing effects and known to bother the affected individual not for days, but rather for years. The plant is covered with tiny hairs and the tip of each hair contains a strong neurotoxin that on being touched breaks off and sticks in the skin. It causes intense, long-lasting aches. Initially, one feels an extreme burning that keeps worsening for about half an hour. Subsequently, it lasts from a few hours to many days, resulting in sleep-deprived agony. In exceptional cases, the agony may extend over years. In 1963, Ernie Ryder, an Australian forester, while working on foliage, a branch of a gimpy gimpy accidentally smacked him in the face and torso. Immediately, he suffered hot, searing, unbelievable pain throughout his whole body. He could not sleep and work for two days, and the agony continued for the next 14 days. The stinging persisted for a complete two years, especially when he bathed in cold water. Can you imagine being in agonizing pain for two years straight, not being able to function properly, not being able to sleep peacefully? That must have been debilitating. Solder Eye An eyelash stuck in the eye creates an itchy feeling. What about a solder getting into the eye? We guarantee it hurts a million times more. Reddit user Smarter's Guy used to work as a plumber. One day he along with his boss was soldering some copper pipes. He held the pipe with a wrench and his boss used a hot torch to apply the solder. During the process, the boss noticed a kink in the pipe and hit the soldering pipe with his hammer to straighten it. A bead of molten hot solder flew off and hit the Reddit user in the eye, searing through his pupil. The immediate pain from white hot solder piercing through his pupil was bad. But that wasn't all as he experienced immense pain for days and felt hurt to blink. He was in agony whether his eye was open or closed. He felt like someone was rubbing his eyeball with coarse sandpaper. The solder had burnt a jagged hole into his cornea. However, fortunately, his eyesight remained intact and unbelievably the injury healed within a week. If it were us, we'd never work with such a reckless boss again. The Heinous Hawk The tarantula hawk wasp is a beastly insect that even tarantulas avoid as its sting can paralyze and kill the victim. These wasps grow up to 4.5 inches in length, whereas the stingers can grow up to 7 millimeters, two and a half times longer than normal wasps. As per insect expert Justin O. Schmidt, in case of being bitten by the tarantula hawk, you can only lay down and scream to feel relieved. Schmidt has created his own pain index rating of 83 different insects, all based on his personal experience. A single sting of a tarantula hawk releases a huge quantity of venom, which is non-lethal to humans, however, it produces a blindingly fierce, shockingly electric pain. 
The pain of this wasp lasts just for five minutes, but it could be a very long five minutes. The beast is so dangerous that if someone has been stung by it and has suffered the pain caused by it, they could probably start crying from the sight of it. Just imagine what would happen if it stings you. You'd probably be rolling around in the dirt while you scream at the top of your lungs and beg the heavens to make it stop. Fish out of hell Kandiru is a dangerous fish and it would be unimaginable to find a fish moving up to someone's peeing part. The Kandiru, a tiny fish, is found in the waters of the Amazon Basin in South America. Spines covering the gills of the fish permit it to attach to other larger fish and feed on the blood, like a tiny underwater vampire. However, in the last 200 years, vampiric accounts of this fish have spread throughout the world, supposedly using their spines to lodge on private parts of humans. In 1997, a man known as FBC was out on the river in Itacotiara in Brazil. Forced by the urge to pee, he climbed into the river, but suddenly a searing pain ran through his undersides. A Kandiru swam up and got stuck in his urethra and was lodged in there with its spine sticking into the inner lining of the urethra, almost like swallowing a rod with sharp spikes. He was put through hours-long surgery. Just thinking about the horrifying pain it caused makes us want to throw up. The man was probably happy to bear the pain of surgery just to get rid of this spiky monster. Unforgiving Fibromyalgia Types of pains mentioned in this video previously are curable. However, sufferers of fibromyalgia know that it is not a simple affair. The incurable condition causes pain throughout the body and also enhances sensitivity to other types of pains. Uninterrupted pain leads to agony. A mildly injured knee might feel like a broken bone. The sufferers of pain feel stiff, fatigued, and find it difficult to concentrate or remember things. Most agonizing is the fact that so far scientists have not been able to discover the cause of the disease. It's linked to both mental and physical factors. Therefore, the trauma of childbirth and the impact of a bad breakup are equally capable of aggravating the issue. They believe that its roots lie in the central nervous system, which incorrectly processes pain. Even the mildest forms of pain are felt like getting stabbed by a knife or getting hit by a truck by the people suffering this devastating ailment. They also suffer from psychotrauma, as they're always exhausted from the pain and are unable to concentrate and their bodies are always stiff. This also adversely affects their memories. The worst part, however, is that once you get it, you're stuck with it for life. Imagine being in unbearable pain all your life. We wouldn't wish it upon our worst enemies. Torturous Torsion Any guy can explain how painful it is to get walloped in the crown jewels. The logic behind this relates to the presence of a huge number of densely packed nerve endings protected by muscles, bones or fat and a small area of the male nether part. Therefore, a solid hit can cause immense pain. Testicular torsion is a condition where the cord that connects man's marbles to the rest of his body twists around and stops the blood supply to the marble. The sufferer feels intense pain and sickness, feverish and dizziness. If torsion is not untwisted within 12 hours, lack of blood can completely kill the testes and resultantly it may need to be removed from the body. But the person suffering from this torsion wouldn't even register the threat of sterility as they're in so much pain it's hard to care about anything else in the world. You'd find these patients in emergency rooms bent over and wailing in agony. Sinister Syndrome You may consider taking a dip in the cool ocean water to be the most relaxing act during hot vacations, but if you happen to be on the Australian beaches where Urukanji jellyfish are found, your vacations could be ruined. These minuscule boxed jellyfish measure just half a cubic inch. They're practically invisible in the waters. These are some of the most venomous jellyfish in the world and are a hundred times more potent than a cobra's bite. Brushing against these minuscules may initially feel just like a mosquito bite, but the pain will start to worsen, making you feel nauseated, causing pounding headaches and muscle cramping. It's known as Itakonji syndrome. Some nurses reported treating patients who vomited every minute for 12 hours and sweated so profusely that their bedsheets were wrung out every 15 minutes. It creates unbearable anxiety, and in certain cases, sometimes the pain was so bad that the victims even perished. The Stone Stent In bad cases of kidney stones, patients might need to undergo surgical removal. After the surgery, your urethra, or tube carrying your pee from the kidney to the bladder, might be a little damaged and not functioning as required. To address the problem, an 11-inch long rubber tube may have to be rammed up your pee hole all the way from the bladder to the kidney. The tube is called a urethral stent, which keeps the ureter open and prevents blockages. The human body does not accept the tube kindly. 
Reddit user Difficult Minute described his experience of peeing bringing him to his knees. For reducing the risk of infection, you need to drink enough water. The stent is attached to a string, and it's pulled out by a doctor after suffering in agony for three months. Antagonistic Ant The bullet ant is a monstrous insect that grows over an inch long. Its sting is so strong and agonizing that some people believe it is the worst one. Schmidt described this sting to be like walking over flaming charcoal with a three-inch nail embedded in your heel. Pain can last a whole day and occur in waves. These blighters are found in rainforests of Central and South America where they sting in troves. After stinging, the bullet ant releases chemicals that signal other ants to follow it. The ants inject ponerotoxin, which causes temporary paralysis, fever, and an irregular heartbeat, but it's not fatal. An indigenous tribe called Satera Mawe in Brazil used the ants in a coming-of-age ritual as 13-year-old children of the tribe must put their hands into gloves full of bullet ants for 10 minutes. Australian comedian Hamish Blake tried to complete the ritual but failed to withstand the pain and had to be admitted to hospital. Who knew an ant was capable of causing the worst known pain to man? It may not be fatal, just excruciating enough to send you to the ER. Outrageously painful Arthritis is a type of joint pain generally related to old age. However, gout can attack people of any age. It's a raw, throbbing inflammation of the joints and occurs to those who indulge in extraordinary use of red meat, booze, and sugary snacks. All these food items contain purines, which are common chemical compounds. The body breaks down purines and produces uric acid. Increased intake of purine-rich diet results in creating a lot of uric acid, and in turn create sharp urate crystals which formulate and accumulate in the joints. The big toe, being farthest from the heart, is the coldest area of the body and accumulates uric acid which is sensitive to temperature changes and only at colder temperatures turns into crystals. In gout, hundreds of tiny, hard, razor-sharp crystals build in the joints and rub against the flesh, leading to aggravated swelling. The afflicted area becomes hypersensitive which results in excruciating pain. Historically, the condition was commonly known as the disease of kings, as only the wealthiest could afford to have lavish food. In the 18th century, it became a status symbol among the aristocracy of Europe. If you're suffering an active episode of gout, it would be impossible to move the affected joint without screaming out in pain. Sometimes it's so bad the person suffering can even get fever and start sweating. The person will probably try killing anyone who touches the inflamed joint. The ache is so bad that even a silk cloth brushing the skin or even a gush of wind can cause searing hot pain in the affected area. We hope you guys enjoyed learning about all these painful things. Do tell us in the comments which one of these you think is the most agonizing. We'll be back soon with more mind-blowing content. See you all next time.